project began as a website about seven years ago now. My art teacher, Linda, I'm still very good friends with her. She had shared an article about a, a young person who had committed suicide because of bullying. There are a lot of adults talking about bullying, but in a sort of condescending way that I don't think is reaching. Our idea was just give them a space where they can say whatever they want to say about it. So we started doing these workshops and it was so powerful. It's amazing to me to see the impact that it can have on somebody. painting. I also enjoy some of clay art. Overall just the vibes of all the different colors and how they can all make an image. I feel so passionate about art and now that they're doing things about bullying I feel like other people should be able to open up and know that you're not the only one who's been struggling. I've been really into drawing, art, and music for a long time, but I've never been able to go to a place where I can like go there and you know freely like express myself on like a canvas or you know an instrument. You can you know you can be free. You don't have to. You don't have to be afraid that someone's gonna like make fun of you in any way. was a photography teacher in high school. I've always been like in her classes, always like, oh, now I remember that this happened and now I know this happens. I don't agree with bullying and I thought it, it's a cool way that we're like showing that bullying is not okay through art and showing it off to the public. I'm in a junior student to student group where we show new kids around the school campus and I think that's a huge part of having kids feel comfortable and sitting with them at lunch but with other kids who are bullied I still think you should do that same thing sitting with them at lunch playing with them having um, a friend to hang out with have like a backstory like there's this one painting I'm working on and the theme is like opposite world where there's like the bully saying like bad words and the other side or the other world is all the po positives and the um, happy words. I would definitely recommend it to people who have or haven't been bullied. It would be a great experience to have and at least like when you're old, you know you can say that you like went and enjoyed it. Like I'll definitely have memories. sports. I like art because you can be creative and you don't have to like do whatever someone says. This is like a place that I can like, I can relate to other people that have been bullied and stuff. 
and I don't have to be like an outstander. powerful project. I love it because this sends out a message to people that have gotten bullied and I feel like you can make a lot of new friends here and express how you feel. I've heard their stories of bullying and they're very sad so I like to take a stand along with people. 